The field of sustainable buildings and sustainable urbanism is at a really exciting stage right now. We think of regenerative sustainability as meaning uh, buildings that actually make things better. And by that we mean both make the environmental conditions better, improve environmental conditions, but also human well-being. By adding a 60,000 square foot building to this campus, we actually reduce the campus's energy use and we reduce the campus's carbon emissions. On water, all our water in SIRS comes from the rain, and the water leaving the building is better quality than the rainwater landing on the roof. So the effect of SIRS is actually to improve the quality of the water flowing through our site. That makes us net positive in water quality. And one that gets less attention is structural carbon. This building is built of wood, and the wood sequesters about 600 tons of carbon. And that's more carbon than all the carbon emitted by the, all of the construction equipment building SIRS and by all the manufacturing processes making everything in the building. And we use geoexchange, uh, lots of solar, building integrated photovoltaics, but also solar thermal. And those are all part of the program. But then our brilliant mechanical engineering consultant uh, said, wait a minute, what's that next door to you? Uh, the Earth and Ocean Sciences building, that's a lab building, and they have a lot of fume hoods. And those fume hoods have 10 air changes are mandated by health and safety regulations. What if we took some of that waste heat? And so what we do is they use 1,600 megawatt hours a year of steam, 990 of heat goes through the roof. We're taking all of that into SERS. We only need 300 and we're giving them back 600 of their own waste heat. So that reduces their use from 1,600 to 1,000, which in turn reduces natural gas burning by about 850. We've adopted uh, two cross-cutting themes to, uh, to express what we're trying to do as a campus, as a university in the sustainability arena. One is an internally focused theme, Campus as a Living Lab, where we use the whole campus as a testbed of sustainability and try to learn the lessons that we can then pass on to others. The other is a more externally focused uh, theme which we call Agent of Change and this is where we want to work in partnership with the public sector, the private sector, the NGO sector to figure out how to change the rules of the game so that sustainability becomes the path. That's the effort we have to put in with our partners is figuring out what rules need to be changed so that natural inclination, the automatic response, is the sustainable one. So there's this massive opportunity. I, I'd like to see every university on the planet see themselves as having this role. And so it's part of a very exciting process we're in the, in the middle of now.